Hello everyone. I haven't done a project or I haven't shown anything that I've done in a while. So I thought I'd show y'all what I was working on. Today I was working on this new book that I'm trying to make this style. Made out of the cardboard. This one's made out of a oh um graham cracker box and the, the washi still I mean not the washi oh, my brain's fuddled today the um Mod Pies is still drying on it but you can start to tell what the cover is going to look like <clears throat> the cover I did with the the um dr used dryer sheets and the way I did it was I used um gesso to put the dryer sheets down and then I gessoed over all the dryer sheets and then I went with some uh, just acrylic paint and painted over that when the gesso was dried and then I distressed it with a little bit darker brown I, I think it'll turn out neat of course I'll have to trim it when it gets finished drying I hadn't figured out what I'm going to do with the spine yet Anyway, I'm excited about that. And I had done a couple more pages in my art journal. I think you've seen that one. I don't know if you've seen this. This is a, just like a little jazz. It's actually a pocket. It doesn't match this background, so I'm probably going to do something else with that background. I might paint it black, I don't know. Y'all seen that one? Oh, and I added, I got these. These are some of the things that some of y'all have sent me. I thought they were cute, and I've added that in there. Of course, I'm not through with that page. I just hadn't thought of what else to do. Let's see. I added this map here. And here I did kind of like a Japanese deal that I'm working on. I don't know if I'm finished with that yet or not. And then the next page I also went with a Japanese theme just so it would kind of match that. And this is also going to be Japanese theme but with a slider different color although I'm going to try to somehow tie them all together I'll have to figure out how to do that um, other than that let's see I've seen that one. Oh, here's where I added another puzzle piece that was sent to me so pretty and then I added this all this stuff was sent to me this little like mini notebook and I left the back undone where I could clip that in there to hold it together I thought that was cute and let's see I added a pocket here. Oh, sorry, my camera was falling. So, you put stuff in there. And I don't know if y'all have seen this one. This is a pocket, too. And I think that's it so far that I've done in here yeah that's it in the journal anyway and I've been working on some more art towels these are the ones that I have finished I have this rose And I just added stickles 
to the rim of the rose and then added some uh, glossy accents to it. And then here's just a little seashell one. A couple of those. Here's a bigger one. I'm trying to bend. And here's one that, with a bird that I added stickles to the um, to the bird and the berries. I'm trying to get where you see it. And then this butterfly. Oh, I think it, it turned out all right, but I wish it. I used clear stickles, but um, it still covers the butterfly up more than I wanted it to. And then I tried, I made this one with some little flowers that I had. And I just used Mod Podge. Just to, see, I was just playing just to see what it would, how it would turn out. It turned out cute. And then here's one where um, I added some dazzling diamond glitter to the waterfall. I think that turned out pretty cool. And then this one. I, I think I really like this one. I colored the face, shaded it, and then I took those tiny little beads. I don't know if you can see, but it's real tiny beads. Let's see if it'll focus. I don't think it's. There it goes. Teeny tiny beads. And I did the background and her lips. And then I did her eyes too. I was just curious how that would look. I think it turned out pretty cool. Her eyes really pop. <laughs> I don't know, just something different I was trying. Anyway, I just thought I would show y'all what I'd been working on. Well, I've worked on. I sent out a couple of pocket letters and some other stuff to a couple of people. So I've been pretty busy on my good days. I had, I had a couple of real bad days with my um, muscles and nerves and my body hurting. But it's all good now. And I'm headed back to Louisiana Monday because my dad is going to have, uh, a, he's got. 70% blockage in, in his carotid or, artery and they're going to go in next week and try to repair it so I wanted to be home for that so y'all keep him in your prayers and thank y'all for watching y'all have a nice day